Hey Slackers, Michael here. We're going to take you on a tour of the Oak Ridge Observatory operated by Harvard University in Harvard, Massachusetts. Aaron took this video when he was there with his astrobiology class. The Oak Ridge Observatory is home to an optical SETI telescope. It's basically a telescope that is looking for aliens who may be shooting lasers at us. These are the grounds of the observatory, which have seen better days. These are the smart people that made this fancy green box, which is the workhorse of the system. Here Aaron and his fellow students in astrobiology class braved the frigid air to look at the 72-inch telescope, which feeds light to the fancy green box. The system can record a trillion measurements a second. They are looking for pulses of light from an alien system, which could carry messages like, hi, or more likely, oh my god, rolling on the floor laughing out loud, dude or maybe some complex mathematical symbology. So the light comes in from where you guys are standing. It bounces off of that. Since it's curved, the, the light rays start to converge. Here the roof is opening because telescopes can't see through wood very well, at least at optical wavelengths. Exciting, huh? This system was dedicated April 11, 2006, and is the only full-time dedicated optical SETI telescope in the world. Planetary music. Something that sounds like Pink like Floyd. Here Aaron's professor, Dr. Bill Waller, shows some burn marks made when the telescope was pointed at the sun one day. They say it was accidental, but... Here they demonstrate they have some special high-tech light switches that go on and off. One of the things we can turn on and off is our telescope. Scotch tape, Sharpie, slacker approved. This is the system they use to track their coverage across the sky. The red lines are areas they've already done. They try to do one stripe per night. It's visible to us. That is the non grayed out part, um, where, painted red. What about those really bright stripes? Where it's brighter red? That's yeah. where we've observed twice. Ah. Now the astrobiology posse makes a trek in the twilight in order to see this, an 84-foot fully steerable radio telescope. It was also used for SETI work in the 90s until a windstorm wrecked it. Here's a brighter pic from a still camera. It was a nice scope, but now not quite in working order. In fact, the optical SETI telescope is the only one still working at Oak Ridge. This 61-inch reflector used to be the workhorse of Oak Ridge, but it too has been decommissioned. Here's Dr. Waller holding the old-fashioned eyepiece. He used to use this scope a few times when he was a student at Harvard. Here's the finder scope used to center on the distant bedrooms they were trying to peek into. A plaque circa 1933. And that's it. Thanks. See ya. Shape up, man. You're a slacker. You want to be a slacker for the rest of your life?